The following program was provided by an independent producer solely responsible for its content. The opinions expressed do not necessarily represent the views of this station, its staff, board of directors, or underwriters. Hi, this is Ken Gidge, and this is the Art of Politics. It's the only show of its type that has one Republican, one Democrat, or two Republicans and one Democrat. And they've even had three Republicans in just myself. <laughs> but <unbelievable>. today, <laughs> see, it's El Sorry, Cancer, who happens to be my, sort of my partner. So why don't we go to camera two and let's. You introduce the guest. Well, I want to introduce my good friend, Representative Peter Leishman, a Democrat. I felt that it was time to bring on two Democrats against one Republican. But before I get into that, I want to show you how I like Democrats. No, 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 wait, wait. Well, you're supposed to shake oh, things. Okay. You, hey, you how are you, Al? Well, nice to meet you. You know, you've got to be, oh, my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You, you yeah. got to be arrogant. It's a pleasure. Ladies and gentlemen, be arrogant to my friend you Peter. know, yeah. I know what he's got in. Is he going to milk it this show with what's in the Boston Globe? That's right. Disgusting. Disgusting. What's disgusting about it is I'm in there with Senator Warren. Put it That's up what's there. Disgusting. Put that thing up there, for yeah. God's sake. Today's sakes. Boston Globe, I was selected as one of the top 150 cream of the crop Republicans in the state. <laughs> cream of the on crop. On who the presidential candidates yeah. come in. Let me have that paper now. Come in and don't throw it out. Come in and meet so they can talk you for endorsements because of my veterans background and being a veterans activist. Naturally, I meet all the candidates. And look, uh, yeah, and ladies and jealous. gentlemen, and also we have right here Kevin Avod, and you happen to be right next to Kelly Ayotte. Uh, there you go, and, Al. and Peter, Jeez. I understand you are a Republican also, or a, no? I'm a Democrat, no, so I'm not in well, that yeah, sheet I mean, there. But you hang Why around with him. Because <laughs> <to, laughs> I don't trust him. No, you I, brought him in. He Al, said nothing uh, yet. Al has a few good points. Yeah. You know, one or two. Uh, so right, yeah, man. name one. Marine. There you go. Sir. Oh, for God. That doesn't count. That you know, doesn't so, come on. Peter and I hung around together for a couple of weeks in Turkey and Azerbaijan. And I covered his back the whole time. Oh, yeah, he did. <laughs> yeah, if you believe was that. He, if got, he was working on his tan. I got okay. in the desert for sale. All right, well, uh, let, well, why don't we just talk about this for a moment, because we've got mm -hmm. plenty of stuff to talk about. Right. And uh, this, by the way, happens to be quite a privilege, and I, and I really mean that, and I don't know, well, because he's a Republican, all right? You know when they have the Democrats? You're not going to see me there, but anyway, uh, he's right up here. He, he is number four in. Uh, this really is truly a big deal, uh, and if you take a look at the inside, you'll learn a little bit more mm -hmm. about him, I guess, but What do they say much. about Al in there? No, I don't really. Just Let me just say, Ken Gidge beats the hell out of him on the art of in politics. In his dreams. That's right. Okay. Ken has very okay. many nightmares. Boston Globe, by yes, the way. This a liberal rag So, <laughs> that's not nice. I'm not a nice person. That's not... Well, we there know we go. that. I mean, but come Truth on. Truth is starting yeah. to dribble yeah. out here. Yeah. Is he going to be a nice guy? Pete, I don't think so. Nice guy, we we yeah. try to be, you know. You know, he's yeah. trying to suck up to you. Please, <laughs> just, all right? Don't, he did don't that do years ago, no, you know. Peter he did that years ago. Well, day I don't care. I just want you to know that. So you bring a Republican on no, who's you hung around with? And excuse me, and he goes to your wedding? 
You and him He's are a this, Democrat. Yeah, he was at my wedding. Him and there him. were yeah. three Democrats. We had to represent the party. Fiscality Every three Democrats were about what equal to, to a... me? Well, because I've I, been good to him for a, for a whole year. Well, because at the time, um, I didn't want... I felt bad. I didn't know how you would act if people started beating up on you. So I didn't want Republicans to pick on you. It, I already know Pete is tough and can it, handle the Republicans. Excuse me. Uh, when Bill O'Brien did this show, and Bill, by the way, was in last week, and it was a great show. It was a lot of fun. It was good, good to see how Bill is doing, et cetera. Uh, but what I find extremely fascinating, all right, no, I'll save that for later because okay. I don't want to get you. <laughs> don't worry about me. I'm a big boy. I get him going. Get him going so here. Yeah, yeah, don't worry about me. Hey, so uh, well, how many? How many terms? Excuse me. And well, hold on. Wait, 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 hold, hold, this is my eighth term. term. Oh, eight how much? Term. Eighth, eighth, term. eighth term. Yeah. You see, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going on four. He's going on eight, and I, this is the first time. Have we ever met each other? I've seen you, but Al told me to stay away from you. See, I'm on my fifth term. I've been around. How come Peter and I worked on many things together, and you haven't? What's the problem? You know, it's really funny. I, 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 you know, he's. I've been there. I'm going, going on my seventh year, and you're going on your sixteenth year. Correct. Yeah, that's correct. All right. Now, you would think after seven years in one room, we would at least walk into each other and say hello. I don't remember seeing you. Well, wow, that's oh. pretty bad because I wow. go up and speak on the floor. He's a so. former chair. I, I'm Fine. sorry. For, well, for Al, did, Al actually did point you out to me, and he said, "You know what? When you see that guy, take the other corridor." Yeah, yeah he. Has I warned him. <laughs> All I right, want him. Al. But I, I told him, I said, "Don't take the other corridor if you meet your take wife." Take the elevator. Yeah, if you meet. Didn't I say yeah. if you meet the? His wife is good, but he yeah. said, "Stay away from your wife." And by the way, uh, she is really enjoying herself up there. That's it's, good. it's quite a. She's sitting right next to Jackie Silly, so okay. guess what? That's that's very interesting in in, in its own. Jackie's uh, very capable, and right. she's in yeah, for governor. Peter. Oh yeah, Jackie. Oh yeah. We travel. Jackie knows Peter, and you don't. <laughs> Who? Weren't you the uh, finance uh, what, what, uh, division one? A couple division of terms. One. A chair. couple of terms. You yep. were the chair. Did he never ever come into the finance committee? Is that what it was? Never. No, I don't huh? think so. No. How many times you see me in there when hearings were going on? Well, Al comes in almost once a week. Mm -hmm. At least once a week, what's going pushing on for legislation. So you don't because even know what's going on. Yeah, I know what's going on. You'd be surprised. All you're looking for is people with cameras. You know, if there's a camera ago, walking down the down the hallway. Geez. Well, how did you end up here? Did you see, I was on How WMR did you end up in the globe? Night. Where? WMR News last night. There you go. Ladies he was going to run against Gene Shaheen, He's but we ham. talked him out of it. Yeah. He's a ham. I decided not because Peter likes Shaheen. Yeah, we didn't want him running against Gene how, Shaheen. How did so. you, no, wait. How did you get on? On the gun bill that uh, was, uh, they had four gun bills yesterday. Catherine Rogers uh, introduced, who's my friend, okay, and she's a Democrat, a liberal, okay? <laughs> get, get, she, get to the gun she, bill. She introduced the background check. She's trying to fix something that isn't broken in New Hampshire. Oh, background check. That's right. Oh, God, we should not have a background we check have back for people Listen, with guns. Excuse me, BS. Peter. Peter, we have Peter background should we have a background <laughs> check? Yeah, I don't have a problem with a background check. Here we check. go, ladies and gentlemen. Now, do you know you and Peter have something in common? Uh, yeah, yeah. we both, know you. Yeah, both voted <laughs> we against hang around the with you. We Two both voted Democrats against what? Both of you voted against the gas tax. That I did, both gas tax, the 4.2 right. and he the 15. Yeah. But I'll tell you what. And his, uh, his was political, No, uh, Well, that's true, but the, but the fact is this. If I didn't think it was going to pass or, or it was going to be close, I would have voted for it. Oh, listen to and, this. And uh, why he is because he was we needed. <laughs> oh, and by the way, gas is down to 225 a gallon. Right, it was, was going down. But it's going to well, go back ladies up. and gentlemen, yeah, so. and we're going to get highways and bridges fixed. No, and give it a oh, so we didn't need them fixed okay. before. You know, since we're on the gas tax and you're in finance, I was just told. First of all, when the vote came in, yeah. the Democrats get up and said, "Your cities and towns are going to get their one percent coming back to you." I just heard that was a scam. That the Department of Transportation said not one cent is going back to the communities. The money raised, actually Al's right, hate to admit that Al is right on this, but the money that was raised in 367, the gas tax bill last year, uh, the money is all going to go back to the DOT for operations. So there'll that? be about a 
$5.2 million cut in local aid. At least that's what the, gov the uh, governor's budget shows at this point. And it's DOT presented to us last Did week. Did you know that we were scammed it, on the bill? It, it, Oh, come on now. Yeah, don't, don't, the no, 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 no. The hold DOT on a second. You don't, the oh, they're going to do nothing on 93, get that no. expanded. You know, they're going to do nothing on the they're bridges. Not gonna do that they're anyways. not going to do anything on In the back roads. You stole 38 Please. million from the Please. gas tax. Please. You want to know something? <laughs> you can, yeah. I'll Am tell, I right? Uh, I'll, operations, I'll yeah. tell you what. Here's a person sitting right there, and you're a smoker. Yeah. All right. Oh, they, we took, we took, we're looking for 21 cents more out of Al, but he'll go to the They took, what, 10? Cents off a pack. We lost forty million dollars. It didn't work no, out. We, did. we get oh, the forty million dollars back. Did we end up with a surplus? You've been in finance well, many years. Actually, he's right on that. We lost out on the ga the right, uh, cigarette lost, tax. We did lose out yeah. there, but did we make up in other areas? No, with the surplus. No, actually, the governor had to cut about nineteen million dollars this go, year to no, kind of balance things Why out. Did the governor have to cut the balance? Was it because of too much spending? No, the actually, uh, not. The revenues are down. Business taxes oh, are down. Interest and dividends so are down. Yeah, so that's... revenues, revenues are actually mm -hmm. down. They're they're down mm -hmm. substantially. The economy's still weak. Mm -hmm. uh, no, no, why are you saying the, that? The, the Republican, said the economy's up. The Republicans drove us so down. At, Far <laughs> down in 2008, I Alan, it's taken us all that. these years to come mm -hmm. back. Isn't still, that the truth? Yeah, the truth. Still Ladies living. and gentlemen, I'm glad I don't have to yell Who at him. We got somebody with hey, intelligence who instead was of me. in charge in 2008? Bush. The Democrats. No, we took over after Bush don't tell me put the country the right Democrats into the hole. New Hampshire on Bush. <laughs> no, no, no. This no. is another <laughs> typical Democrat blaming Bush for New Hampshire. Only telling the truth, just like I told the truth about you were right on the DOT. Yeah, okay. You know, always hey, tell the truth. You, how much? No, how no, much, no, no. Wait, 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 hold on. Wait, 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 Al. Al, Al, hold on a second. How much stimulus money did you take in 2008 from Obama? That to this state, uh, in a, I couldn't say specifically, but hundreds of millions of yes. dollars that were used to help balance our budget. That's right, and it threw yeah. the state off big time, didn't it? Well, we took the money, and it wasn't there but in the next budget cycle, two ten. That's like so. And, the federal and, dollars did, in and fact, did help they us not out. do something with the 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 uh, what they was it the, the hospital the bed thing that Thank screwed you. them up where they didn't pay the money back, and now how, we have to pay that money back? Hey. No, wait, hey. see. What Al's going to tell you is that we inflated the budget by, what, 17? I keep yeah, hearing that, 17%. 17. Yeah. That wasn't, that's not true again. What we did was we took federal money and up the budget. So the general fund dollars did not go up. But we did take federal dollars that try to help the state out. A lot of that went and back to the community. And there's nothing wrong with that. And didn't you bond money for Operation Bill cost, too? We did some. There was some bonding for DOT. Yeah. Okay. Did you also so sell it, a road uh, for $10 million there? It was like taking it out of one pocket to the other from the from the state of New Hampshire over to Pease, um, the what they call Well, it was actually the uh, bridge on 95, which was a DOT bridge, was absorbed by the Turnpike Authority. So there was a transfer of funds from the right. Turnpike Authority to the local community. So we took a bridge that was on the local, state system. Local Smoke communities. communities. Yeah. Local communities. communities. We learned that from the Republicans hey. because Al, every tax, every tax in the state of New Hampshire that we have now were instituted by Republicans. I have, every tax. I have to agree the, with only, my the only thing that we've done that has uh, shown any real impact was we increased the um, rooms and meals from 8 to 9%. Yes. That's something the Democrats did, but every tax Business enterprise tax, business profits tax, rooms and meals were all Republican no, taxes. And yeah, by the right. way, when yeah, Bush, when that. Bush, <laughs> when Bush screwed everything up, right? Then it was twice as bad. And the Republicans, you know, they they won't take the credit for that, of course. No, no I definitely the uh, Republicans, and there's enough blame to go around more so in Washington than no, here in Congress. I got a question. What do you do? I never knew because you're always up in the state. What do you do for a living? I'm in the railroad business. No way. Yeah. You're kidding no me. Yeah, so no. I take it you're supporting that uh, bloated $300 million that the governor wants to take from the taxpayers and pay for a study? Well, I'm actually not supporting that. Um, and the reason why you're not supporting that? Well, there are actually a number of reasons. One, it's too expensive. And one of the things, all the studies, we've done at least three studies, and each study has taken millions of dollars 
to study something that we already know is going to require a state subsidy. Right. Yes, but and, Peter, uh, you're in the railroad business. Are you trying to tell me there's no comp wouldn't be any competition of any type for you? Well, they wouldn't. I'm in the freight business. This is passenger. This had nothing to do with passenger. So this had, this is passenger rail from Nashville up to Manchester, and. Uh, the program that we've seen you know, for the last 10 years is about a $300 million program to bring rail from Lowell to Nashville, Manchester, and Concord. And uh, the concern that I and I'm not alone, but just happen to uh, be in the business, is the state now is having a difficult time meeting their expenses. There's no doubt about mm -hmm. You can blame Republicans or Democrats. The economy is still a little weak. And there is just no way the state, in my opinion, can support a subsidy but, for commuter rail. But you've been rail. in the rail how many years? About 30 years. Freight, so only so freight. More of a, you're an expert then in this area, I would think. Well, yeah. I don't know about an expert, but I do know what the costs me, are per mile and what mm -hmm. uh, it let should cost. Let me ask you a question. If it was Excuse me, do you, do you plow your tracks, by the way? Uh, we actually, we only operate in the, if you will, peak construction months. We haul gravel and stone. So we haul... From where to where? Uh, Wilton down to Milford. So like a six-mile run. We've oh, been doing okay. it since 92. Oh, okay. And then I worked for uh, the Boston and Maine prior to that. Okay. That's good. Yeah. So he's got some experience in there. So hopefully you're going to listen. Yeah, wait a minute. Six <laughs> miles, of, that's not much experience. No, he's been doing He's been in the railroad you, you business. Know, you, know something, <laughs> you know something? He sounds like a Republican mm -hmm. when he makes the point that it's going to cost New Hampshire a lot of money to get the rail and you can't pay for it. Guess what? Mm -hmm. We're the only, what, state What's, in the United States that doesn't have railroad you, coming well, into we our actually, state? We actually, we've always been very good, and we joke about this on the Finance Committee in the House. We always look for the guy behind the tree to pay our costs, and it's whether you're a Democrat or Republican. Now, we do have Amtrak service in the western part of the state, stops in Claremont. We don't subsidize or pay for that a bit. And then we have the Down Easter service that runs from Boston to Portland. Now it's been extended up to Brunswick. Stops in Dover, Durham, Exeter. Right. My, my oh, son yeah, at UNH used yeah. to okay. take it. Yeah. And we pay nothing for that. So, so we're why, very good. Why for, couldn't they do that if it was uh, worth the money? Why couldn't they do that in, in Nashua? Well, the state of Maine subsidizes the Down Easter to a tune of about oh, $8 million. So Maine see, is subsidizing. Oh, okay. There was a so federal grant. So they're not free. Oh, they're not free. There's no. They're not free. See? You want the taxpayers you see, you to see give what more I mean? money. Oh. That's what you want. <laughs> you know, you're not, you're, you know, sometimes I try to try to understand you. Look, Al, you need another form of transportation. And by the way, could you expand your business if this came through and the tracks were? No. no you could. We were pretty much isolated from the commuter rail business. We used to operate a tourist line, about 18-mile tourist line. But when the owner died, we actually gave that up because again every railroad in this country but as most transportation modes are, are subsidized where this highway airplanes uh, are subsidized and in this particular case I've always been a supporter of at least getting it to Nashua it's 10 rail miles from Nashua to Lowell that's it in the typical cost per mile range from eight hundred thousand dollars a mile to one point two million dollars a mile for upgrade so, as I said repeatedly, if we hadn't used the money uh, for all these studies, the three and the governor is looking for another $4 million to study the uh, environmental impact of this project, we'd probably have the rail to Nashville years ago. Well, y y yes, no. Well, you uh, wrong. You, no, no, you, 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 you constantly <laughs> use the wrong. word study. We don't have to study we don't, it anymore. We shouldn't be studying it what, anymore. And we what don't. we have to do is convince the Republicans that railroad is important. No, it's, it, no, it's no. not important. Let me put it, if it's going to cost, first of all, you whine and cry, I mean, the whole time, five shows about <laughs> mental health, mental health. But now you forgot about mental health. You want to take more money and go into real world. Al, I don't get it. With we you got Democrats. your medication paid for. I don't get I'm it. I'm not complaining <laughs> anymore. I don't, I don't you get needed it. the medication. We got you the medication. No, I don't get medication. From Did the you state. get up in front of the full house and say that last week you were working on your tan? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to Florida tomorrow. Yeah. Look at him. Yeah. Hey, He's an to, Italian. I was in Florida two weeks ago, my wife and, you're and going, I. You're going back. And I'm going back tomorrow. 
for a week. All right. So anyway, he's got a tanning bed up in the state house. There's a yeah. room up there. He's got a tanning bed in one of the back rooms. I know. I, I, I'm the poor English guy. You know, the the real Did white guy. Did you like guy. my speech, by the way? Pardon me. Did you like my speech? On no, the, uh, actually. Inspections? No, 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 that was terrible speech. Did you vote? Why were you talking about you eels vote? and snakes and Get, dogs? I'm going to talk to the kids. Alligators. <laughs> alligators. <laughs> there was a bill to extend inspections on vehicles every two years because many people own new cars. Why are you digging in your pocket every year to have your car inspected? When you got a five year warranty and you take care of your vehicles, but we could not get the Democrats and about 70 Republicans that voted, and they said, nope, you don't know better. That committee, Ali, voted like 15 to 1. All I those Republican mem That's friends of yours. You That's know? why I it's said about... It was 15 to 1? Something I, like I that. I didn't know... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Al. About 70 oh, Republicans Al. So wait, wait a minute. So and that, 140 that, that, Democrats. That, that means the oh, tiny little bit of you... Republicans go, oh, yeah. no, but no, no. But the majority every, of the Republicans every, every 40 voted years. against it. Oh, and guess what? Oh, and I, guess what? <laughs> if you guys had your way, you would have no inspection. Did you say mm. that or not? Yeah, in Florida, you have no there inspections. You go. In New Jersey, you have no inspections. Yes. Canada got worse weather than us. They only inspect if the car sits for a year. They're required or if it gets in an accident or they get a first inspection when it's new. That's it? Well. You want a revenue source. You want your hands in people's pockets. Am I right? <laughs> why, why, do you, why does he say yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. Why does he well, say that? Know, we got to get the revenue from wherever we can, Al, if it's from inspections yeah, or uh, cigarettes. You know, right. We same don't have a sales or income yeah. tax. How about tans? Is there a way we can well, we are gonna start, take, take was, a picture of him and then when he, you know, he, he, you know he tans, we charge him more money? You know, so you Democrats are supposed to be for the little people. I consider myself one of the little people. I live on a budget. You are kidding me. When you put me. in a cigarette tax, you go after people like me and the working class a people. Little, okay, now, so the, okay, okay, the little people. I have a pocket. I'll, if you've got deep uh, pockets, they don't the, care. The, the I have a little people question for you. We've got 34,000 people that have taken advantage of Obamacare right now, the Affordable Care mm -hmm. Act. Uh, there's legislation coming forward in the governor's budget because in 17, we have to start picking up a portion, 5%. 5%. And that's the last six months of 17. It's $12 million. Yeah. But those 34,000 people mm -hmm. are people that can't afford health insurance. I so they're, they're the minute, little people, as you call Dana, them, that can't afford health true, insurance. Dana. So how are we going to take care so, of them? Wait, so so are you insurance. saying that he's not a little person? Do well, a, he's a big guy, yeah. but I'm just he's wondering what he guy. said. Do a Google little, search <laughs> yeah. and look up the 22,000 people on there that lost their insurance because of Obamacare. That are on the government. Pete, Pete, well, Pete, does that make any forced sense? To go on the government. Am I right? Who's, who's sponsoring that website? That's a Republican website, no, Al. No, I'm pretty 22,000 sure. people in New Hampshire <laughs> lost their insurance. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, no. I'm glad he came on. A Republican <laughs> <laughs> website. Somebody, yeah. Shame on you. <laughs> Shame <laughs> on <laughs> you. <laughs> I am telling you. Democrat answer my Yay. question. Peter, yeah, well, Peter over Leachman, ladies and gentlemen, people he's got the numbers. Insurance. See, I've, I've heard that figure. I've heard less. I've heard more just like the 17% budget increase. And our budget went up less than 1% in general funds because we took those federal funds it. earlier. It was 17%. But... <laughs> but uh -huh. As I've argued with some of my Republican friends up there, they'd rather see us send all that money mm -hmm. down to your former right. state of Massachusetts, those federal funds. And if we can obtain those federal funds in this state, we ought to, because right. we've I mean, always been a... It's our tax money. It's our tax back. money. We've been right. for years no, agree with giving more money to Washington I, than I, we have I under agree. the Affordable Care Act. We're finally mm -hmm. getting close to balance. not only did you do that, take the federal money, it's like running your family off a credit card. What are you instead talking of, about? Instead of living within the means what are you state, talking? Right? We, we still have a did very we, good credit rating, Al. Did, very good credit rating. Did we rating. go down? And then now we're back up because of the Republican budget. Did we go really? down? We had a, a bipartisan <laughs> budget last time. It was almost unanimously <laughs> supported in the House, as you recall. Bipartisan. And unanimously supported in the Senate, Wait. Democrats bipartisan. and Republicans. That budget, the governor went around the state hey, chewing hey, up the senators. Hey, Al. <laughs> Did she do that? Did hey, no good those all, senators? I, I, I don't know. As, she realized she couldn't do anything. As, she changed As them. you say to me, Al, as you say <laughs> to me. I don't know, you know. 
know, my I, numbers, you mm -hmm. say, hey, do a Google search. Do a Google. Hey, do a Google search if you think he's wrong. I know he is. You, want you know he's wrong? Yeah, check wait, wait. that out. Check uh, that out. See check what, that out. Okay. Hey. And see who's sponsoring that website. What we're talking yeah. about. <laughs> Please, let's what get it. What we're talking. This was in the newspaper. The... Uh, What's the one? The, well, you uh, can't always believe what you read in the newspaper, no, the, Al, like this guy here, Al Baldazaro up here. Yeah, what's the liberal newspaper there in, um, mm -hmm. that's in Dover area? What's that paper? Foster's. Foster's. But they're not that's that liberal, Al. Yeah, they're they pretty are. conservative. They're a liberal newspaper. They there. supported you know, Brown over Shaheen, I believe. Well, look at Shaheen. Come on. Hey, she's, a late, she's the best we've ever had. I don't know. <laughs> you don't know. Lady. That's right, yeah. Al. You mm -hmm. don't know. I had to talk Al. He's going to run against Jeannie, and I said, no, nah, you're wasting your time, Al. You know, She's going to win. You can put the word out to the Democrats that this may be my last term. Yes. It, well, I'm uh, seriously thinking about uh, be, moving to Florida. Yes, and, and by He's way, already told us that, yeah, and we've already taken up and a collection can, to he, get him out of state. As long as you <laughs> know me up at the state house, have yeah. you ever heard me say that I was done? Until recently. Only a week ago, you Only? stopped in the office yep. and Never told me that. We promise <laughs> I'll get you a one-way ticket you? on a yeah. Greyhound bus. Well, you, know, you know what it is? The but real it, truth. My medical condition, I, the cold, I just Your can't. medical I condition. I can't deal with the cold. And by the way, he talks about being a, a little man. He's the only person I know who can walk outside his house with a gun and go shooting. What's wrong with that? Sick you can yeah. too. I was over at his house. Everybody that was over at his house for his wedding was armed with an assault remember? rifle, except Look. us. Remember? There we go. Yeah, right there. There's... That's my wooden picture. <laughs> Show that. See if you can get that to the camera. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, th these are assault rifles. This is one of these. No, these... they're not assault rifles. <laughs> Those aren't it's assault rifles? You know, sir. <laughs> no, they're not. Wait, an AR-15 okay, is like a, a, a yeah. They're not assault rifles. An AR-15 is like any other rifle. It's just a different suit. <laughs> we got different suits on. Right. And, and one makes a tiny mm -hmm. hole, and one, and makes, one a makes a big hole. hole. Okay. If that's case, one is louder. And one is if softer. If that's the case, then a, 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 an M14 M is a 7.62. A, uh, a AR-15 is a 5.62. So tell me, you're going after I felt the very AR. safe over at his house because you know? everybody did at least have something to protect me with. Did they have, well, they all had guns, huh? Just about everyone there had a gun. I was in some kind of a buddy going to you. You know something? I love it. I love it. Excuse me. I, I, I don't want to get into the godfather or anything, but, you know... Everyone goes to your wedding and they're all carrying a gun. <laughs> Gee, oh, hold on, yeah. folks. Hey, you we know, so, have <laughs> you know, Well, I'm looking here. Let's get back yeah. to the train thing. Okay. I'm, I'm impressed that a Democrat really thinks that. I mean, you know. That, well, that, it's just priorities. Just... It's priorities. Do we spend our money on roads and bridges or do we spend them on rail? Like I said earlier, I could support getting it to Nashua, but the state. The only thing I could probably guarantee in this legislative budget is the $4 million that's being requested will probably not get into I, the budget. I got a question. Yeah, why, do you, go why do you think our revenues are down? Well, there are a number of reasons. The interest in dividends, receipts. The economy is still weak. Uh, rooms and meals, that's actually been pretty stable. But our business taxes cigarette continue taxes to decline. No, actually, cigarette taxes have been stable. But our biggest sources of revenue have been the business taxes, and they have been constantly declining, along with interest and dividends. I understand liquor was down also, our liquor warehouses, and they used the excuse, oh, they were shut down for a while on... Uh, on liquor has own. not... Al's actually right. Liquor has not been performing as well as it used to. Expenses are up. Uh, revenue is down. There's still some friction between the now, how do I know this law stuff? warehouse transfer Peter. to Excel. Yeah, I know. The I mean, laws from Nashville, by the way. Stuff. Yeah, very Lots good people. How does Al Baldassar, the Republican, know this stuff? Because you hang out at finance all the time. I come into finance <laughs> where my buddy here yeah. didn't even know who you were. And you went up there 20, 30. He used to ride you in a horse and buggy when he didn't have <laughs> well, not quite that long there ago. Here we but, go. Uh, well, let me tell you, everyone at your... Wedding with a gun. I'm not <laughs> sure if I like that. You know? We all what? felt pretty well protected, or we knew that we wouldn't leave the That's property right. yes, without but, permission. But you heard from someone Al. yelling when and we screaming. Turkey, you got in your did car, you got out of well there. Protected? Well, Al pulled me away from the riots. I have to give we him were, that we credit. We were there. <laughs> did you know we were there during Except the riots? I got a question. I have a question. During your wedding, did anyone shoot a gun out in the back? No. 
Mm-mm. No shooting a gun? No, we I didn't. heard some rapid fire as we were leaving, but I thought they were <laughs> shooting over my car. There was just Democrats. <laughs> John Burt and a few others that were there, you know, were all comparing notes of the type of guns that I have and the type of guns they have, and they're well armed, I can say that. Which, by the way, last Sunday, uh, which I didn't know, there's a new gun range over in Hudson on Hampshire Drive, I believe, and we went over there. John Burt, who is a Republican, who uh, was in fishing game, he is now trying to get uh, uh, a bill that hunters can use suppressors on their guns. So we, I believe, 40 plus uh, representatives went over there, and that was was not a good day. And we were all surprised, and we all shot the guns. Uh, and I can tell you, uh, I don't. First of all, they 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 there's less noise, but there's still a lot of noise. There's no question about I that. I think the more noise, the better when you're out hunting. Give those deer a little more of an advantage. But. Well, oh, but I'll tell you. Save me. You, you know, there we go. I know, but you know kill something? The, kill the unborn, but save Bambi. Yeah. That's I beautiful. think they, they need to hear the shots so they can run yeah. and hide, Al. That's all. You Democrats are unbelievable. <laughs> save Bambi. Kill the unborn. That's a beautiful Here we thing. go. Uh, go ahead, Al. Yeah. Wait, get, get the camera on him, please. Yeah. <laughs> save Bambi, kill the unborn. That's right. Man. And how many That's guns do you have in your house? I got enough. And I, you <laughs> shoot some ducks out the back? I got enough. I have it. I actually, I never gone hunting. I was. Uh, how could you go not hunting. go hunting? Right outside your house, you got ducks? No, I just never. Well, tell them, Al. You went hunting them. at that range, and they had all those Democrats lined oh, yeah. up. You went hunting I for put them. Pictures up. <laughs> I did. Used to be did they really? <laughs> he did. They had pictures of all these Democrats yeah. and like they who? mowed them right Name down. One. Ken Gidge. Yeah, he did. He had. Uh, he showed me a picture of you and he said, "This is that guy Gidge." <laughs> yeah. See, he didn't realize who you were because you weren't shining as much, you know. Then, so he didn't know. So, <laughs> uh. <laughs> so, uh, so how many years more do you think you're going to be up there? I oh, know. I don't know. As long as they keep sending me back, I, I do know. enjoy it. I do enjoy finance and. The Finance Committee is generally not very partisan, if you can believe that. Al came in uh, two years ago or three years in the budget he cycle, and he had a bill to uh, provide a scholarship for uh, the Amazing. National Guard for just one year, and we thought it was a good enough bill that we put it in for two years. So mm -hmm. we're not even, and that's when the Democrats were in charge. Right, and we yeah. looked at Al and said, well, you know, we want to take care of our veterans they and were, National were, Guard. He was right behind it. So, uh, you know, so come out on a good vote. And, uh, but we also know they're well armed, so that actually helps twist our arm to you know, you get the and, and, legislation and, and, passed. You know, if we, could, if we could only know if they're still on their meds, it would feel a lot better. You know, some. But wait a minute. How about the guns a, up in the state house? Oh, the great, a great decision. Well, well, what we was were, it? Democrats and Republicans both were carrying, anyways, with the rule. Well, what is the rule? The rule is you can carry. No, concealed. the rule is... You can carry concealed. No, the rule is... Get it out. Get it. It's not that me. you can carry. What is it? The rule is you can't show it. Did you not understand what concealed <laughs> does means? It, does it, you cannot show it. Did that you make not any understand sense? what concealed well, means? But you can't have it. And in fact, okay. aren't there penalties for people you? who go, hey, look. Did I, did I confuse you on using the word concealed? No. Hey, What's look. You can get fined Don't for show. showing your gun. Well, All see, right. do you see what Al, I did? Yeah. Al's actually right. I, I was first elected. I took a few years off from the legislature, but I was first elected in 96. And I sat next to a number of people during my first terms up there that were all carrying weapons. Yeah. Nobody said anything. Nobody said anything. Right. But everybody no. had a gun. Women carried a pistol in their Republicans pocketbook. Republicans Democrats. Then they did. And, and, oh, we, we know yeah. that. Yeah, we It's know. always it, been and in a fact, quiet... If you want to count who they are, when when we can take off our jackets because yeah. it's like eighty degrees. Right. Al keeps his jacket on. Al keeps yeah. his jacket on. Yeah, yeah. he's he's carrying. <laughs> yeah, there's no question that. about that. Never, I'm not going to ask you if you got it on you right now. No, Bill O'Brien keeps his jacket on yeah. too. You'll never yeah. ever but know. But he doesn't carry a gun, can. does he? He's Do you my know first I've been cousin. A couple times. Huh? Do you know, over the gay marriage, I used to get threatening phone calls when I uh, led the charge on repealing gay marriage. I had one guy call and tell me he's going to come over to my house with a set of brass knuckles. Two years ago... Brass I, knuckles? Yeah, and beat the, I, I said, look for the Marine Corps flag. I said, I, you know, I'm on the phone book. I live at 41 Hall Road. Was that you know, another Republican, Al? No, probably a Democrat or a liberal. Uh, you know, uh, same thing. Uh, did you say leave the light on? 
No, yeah. You gave the wrong address. No, no. We know you gave the wrong no, address yeah. because, yeah. because your neighbor got beat up. How many times do I your get my neighbor address got on this beat show? Up. To stop. How many times do I get my address and on this I show? And I told you, we're getting a bus, yeah. and we're, we're all going to meet, says, and we're going to go over to his house. You know? <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Like the you know, the Republicans in his neighborhood, you probably got that sign that says, He's not ours. <laughs> okay, do you have, do you have so, uh, uh, some sort of a bill that you liked or disliked uh, this week that took place? Yeah, actually a couple of them. Okay, uh, go ahead and mention them. Let's I, I uh, sponsor the right to work and the one that exempts the police and the fire. And I interest Right to that. work, right yeah. To you work. should allow people to make that decision whether they want to join a union or not. I do. I agree. But, That's you know, right the to right to work is. basically forces people that they can work at a facility... And if it's unionized, they can tell the union folks to go pound sand after all the employees decided they want to have a union okay. shop. You don't force anyone to have a union shop. It's up to the employees. If an employee does not want to be part of a union, they should have that choice. They should negotiate themselves their own pay. They should not have a union. My wife, okay, is a computer, has a computer science degree. You know, my yeah. wife's very... Uh, Judy's very... I don't know... I, he did find a very nice yeah, woman. I don't wife, know how wife, that happened. Well, she but carries a gun, too. My wife <laughs> she does. Angel, <laughs> and she's a computer science, a GIS administrator. It must be a tan. Geographical information system. She's okay. a big geek. So, so Listen to me where I'm going with this. Your point is My what? My point is, when she negotiated her job, a new job for a city in Massachusetts, once she got working, a month later, the union comes after her. Oh, you, you have to join the union. Why? You didn't do anything for me. You didn't get me my job. You didn't negotiate. But rather than cause any problems because some people were saying things, whatever, her not wanting She joined the union. She joined the union out of fear, you know, uh, uh, intimidation. Oh, so, come on, fear, so now, Al. Come on, with so, you as a husband, so now, she wouldn't be fearful. So now they're taking money out of my wife's pay that should go to her kids. Instead, she got to pay yeah, a union oh, go, bosses. No, go to, go to the poor people. I mean, Al... <laughs> You're getting I, I, them going you, here. You, I can you, see the do you, boil. Do you, do, you real, do you realize, Peter, that what he says, and it exempts who? The police and the firemen. It exempts who? You know something? You're a chicken. Because <laughs> uh -oh. you are a chicken, <laughs> yellow chicken. You say right to work, but it exempts who? The police and the firemen. Guess what, Al? Well. That's right. Those are the people who said to you, if you play that game with us, you're not going to get elected. That's why well, you're attempting that. I got elected. I come on number one. I think you're not being honest. Be honest. I'm not honest. I led the charge before, why, and I still come on number why one. Why are you <laughs> accepting? Right, he, is, right, right he, does, he does come out number one over in no. his town. I'm not sure how. Can I move on a second? And you exempt the uh -oh, police he's found and the some... firemen. Uh -uh. What are one of the most liberal right. newspapers in the state? The union leader. <laughs> I don't the know. Monitor. The Concord Monitor. Are they quoting you in the area? Renewal an option for canceled New Hampshire insurance plans. Can I show this here? Okay. Where's it go here? 22,000 were um, lost there. About 22,000 New Hampshire residents have been notified that their individual health insurance plans are being discontinued because they don't comply with the federal health care overhaul law, but they can keep their benefits for another year because uh, Obama to uh, executive because Shaheen was uh, running for ex election. Ex they worked it all out, though, Will. No, all no, those no, people they, have insurance now. They lost, now. Well, now they lost They it. all have insurance they now. They lost it, and they went to Medicaid expansion. <laughs> These were the working people. But they still have to pay for that Medicaid expansion. They went to Medicaid. They were on the government dole. These are working people that had, you know, some you, above you, minimum you know, wage. Paying for their own you, insurance. You know, now they have to depend you, you on know, the government. You know, Al, one, of, one, of, the re we did. one of the reasons why they were losing insurance is because, and this was from, you know, where we are in, in, up in Commerce. Okay. One of the reasons is they made it illegal for us to form an That's insurance exchange. That's not true. Yes, it is. You were in then, finance. And then? Well, now we've actually <laughs> straightened out the problem. Now every hospital is able to participate. We have like four or five carriers in the state that are providing insurance. Yeah, that's what I heard. And 34-plus yeah. thousand people that have insurance that never did yeah. before. I, heard the I think that's substantial. I heard the Republican senator there was the one to take the credit for that. They 
straighten that out. They took the credit for it. Because they're the ones it's that a good bipartisan. It, it was a good bipartisan move. <laughs> I and, love and, the they, Democrat <laughs> using the bipartisan. Excuse me. Don't you like that? Yeah. It was a good, <laughs> it came out of the Democratic House, and the, I have to give a lot of credit to uh, Senator Morse, the Senate president. Yep. It's worked Jeff out Martin, a good compromise. Yep, a good compromise. Yep. Others, you know, Republican senators, they push those people aside, but there were some very forward-thinking senators like Carson and right. uh, Morris and for Forrest. I understand there's a bill coming and forward. And you want to know something, though, Peter, if they thought they could get away with it, if the people hadn't talked to them, they, would, they wouldn't have... Uh, uh, passed it uh, well, in a positive way. I think Al can you be right. Al I didn't support Medicare have, expansion. Have you voted for the budget, didn't I you? Did budget, you vote for the yeah. budget? Right. Okay, Peter, he voted for the budget, yeah. so he voted for what? I did. voted for everything that we wanted done. No, the, the Republicans. Oh, yeah. The Republicans. Oh, Al. <laughs> I, I didn't want to shut Poor down the Al. government. I had no choice. Poor I, didn't, Al. I didn't vote for the Democrats two first two Ladies months. Now, do you guys I'm... ever swing at each other? Do no. I have to get out here? I, you know. I, I, next, I, next week, he's going down to work on his tan. <laughs> <laughs> Please stay. Hey, you know, my first two terms, I didn't vote for the Democrat uh, spending spree. With those projected revenues they pulled out of the sky. Weren't you there at midnight when you caucused and came back with numbers that you can... We raised the budget. We, we, we managed to get by, yeah. though. We managed to right, get by. Yeah, but Al didn't support us. That, that I have to say, uh, he didn't support us for a couple of terms. Deficit. They did a great job. Now, it was all taken care of with that stimulus money, Al. So oh, we didn't Ryan. have a deficit. We did didn't have a deficit. Did come in and tighten the budget? Well, he definitely tightened it, and all the people were out in the street. Like who? Look at the mobs of people around the state house. They were there before. Under tens the of thousands, no, tens were, of thousands of people around the state house. The Democrats. House. The developmentally disabled they were cut. They were there under the Democrats. <laughs> I had to come back and file a bill. Yeah. <laughs> I did. I had to file a floor amendment on the House floor uh -huh. to support the developmentally disabled because my friend, not Al, but the Speaker, cut the developmentally disabled. And the Republicans and Democrats. How did we cut them? Tell me how they cut the it. funding. The wait list came back by hundreds we of added individuals. Money to the wait list. After our amendment was put forward, a Democratic amendment supported by some Republicans like yourself. But there was a bipartisan uh, amendment, as you say. Yeah, but O'Brien's budget. Why did you say that was a bipartisan amendment? Because it was, because we had oh, good. See, I had to get the bipartisan amendment. We no, no, did no, no, have no, that. No, 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 but wait, it was wait, during wait, wait. the O'Brien years. The O'Brien budget cut things that were very important to the state. O'Brien budget had no choice. How much was the deficit? Did we, we didn't have a deficit. You just eight hundred million dollar. We didn't have the funding from the federal anymore eight, because the federal government right. said, "Look at those okay. Republicans running New Hampshire. Did We're not going we to help them out anymore." There you spending. go. Yeah. Just for, <laughs> just for being a Republican, Republican now. Did O'Brien have to make up for that eight hundred million dollars we didn't have from the federal government? No, he didn't because it wasn't coming anyway. We knew that it was a one-shot deal for but paving. You raised, you raised uh, mental health. You raised all these programs with that money. You Everybody even, knew it was a one-shot deal. Everybody knew it was a one-shot deal. They, it was all federal all stimulus money. I, money I, I the love card. Peter. Peter, come back next week. Uh, <laughs> please do that. Oh, Al. Yeah. You all even got money, borrowed you know, money, bought money. This, this, money. this show <laughs> is going to show that I have talked the least. Mm -hmm. Am I right, Pete? Hey, Hey, not Peter. all right, Al. I Pete, have to say, we're, Pete, we're not at all in agreement on Peter, this one. Get him, the get him, Peter. Budget, get him, Peter. The O'Brien budget was catastrophic to the state of New Hampshire. It was just devastating to the state of New Hampshire. That's why the Democrats Whoa. came back, because the people of New Hampshire said, look what O'Brien did. I wonder why he's saying this there here. You go. Let me tell you, it's a family he's a thing. Yeah, it's a family <laughs> thing, you know. Hey, listen to me. Yeah, yeah, he's going to fall right out of his chair this. now. Yeah. Hey, no. Al, chicken. Let, let, <laughs> Listen to me, I'm going to get my tan. We're almost week. out of time, Al. You better. Do you know, did you hear no, what I said? don't know anything Listen. from you anymore. I'm listening to him. It's a family, it was, yeah. it got, family thing. Do you know where I'm going with this? Family, family thing? thing? No. Do you know he's Bill O'Brien's cousin? First cousin at that. I know all about his what? policies. What? <laughs> it's a family yeah. thing. What? Yeah. What, what do you mean? What's they, the Republican? They, did, they didn't eat at the same table. Yeah. So now you naturally you know where the it's coming from. The eating out there. I'm eating in yeah. here. <laughs> there we go. Now okay. You see why. All right. Yeah. You, all right. That's that's for you and your bill. What do you? What took place this week up there that uh, interests you? Maybe it was a bill that you had a bill that you didn't like. Something that took place you didn't like. Something you loved. Slow down, Peter. Slow down, boy. There's a lot of stuff to love and hate. Um, <laughs>
Reggie, that could be a concern because a lot of money is given back. For... Explain Reggie. Uh, Reggie is, uh, there are pollution Excuse credits and what they companies do, give money to the state so we can use that money for energy efficiency upgrades. And there's okay. millions and millions of dollars that have come back through these pollution credits and have gone out to make homes more fuel efficient, businesses what more else? fuel efficient. What else? And uh, training. Well, there's jobs. There's job training, and the legislature, in fact, uh, voted to recommend to the Senate that we should do away with Reggie. And this is despite the folks coming in and I from it. business and industry. Mm -hmm. uh, the PUC, the Public Utilities Commission, came out and explained the value of it. So that was a kind of a surprise. I thought perhaps the uh, House would go along with that continued program, but it still has to go to the Senate. Didn't Unfortunately, we, did, you have a Democratic a governor a that will veto the legislation. Yeah, isn't there so, an amendment for it? Do a rebate back to the uh, people? Yeah, there was an amendment that was put forward that uh, would mm -hmm. rebate some of the money back yeah. to the and actually weaken the funds from what we know now, today. Now, let me tell you about these funds, the money you're uh, taking. I'm going to tell you how my district uh, benefited. Let me, can oh, I tell wait, you? Wait, no, 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 no. See, now, his, he, he actually, his town you, took a lot of this Reggie town, money. He no, took wait, a lot wait, of the wait, Reggie money? Me. Come on, come Stony on. Stonyfield, how did he take it? Yeah, Stonyfield Stony 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 took, was given by Governor Lynch $178,000 of this money, taxpayer. To do what? That are paying more energy to train people for work. To do what? To train people for Wait work. Wait a minute. Train people for work? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No, train no, people for work? I'll wait till he gets done. Do <laughs> you want to know how many people they put to work? Yeah, go to Florida. Do you want to know how many people they put to work? How many? Three. 178,000 of people when they could have got lower cost on energy. And yeah. they're all Republicans. <laughs> Three people. 178,000 it, it, dollars. It's true. It's a slush fund. It's a scam. No, no, no. No, no it's, it's a... In other states around us, all the states around us participate. And if we don't participate, we won't New be Jersey's able to take... Pulling out. Well, we don't know that for yeah, sure Jersey's, yet. Jersey's but all the New England out. states participate, so we won't be able to take advantage of those credits that New Hampshire will get back. So What, what credits? Oh, wait a minute. Never, that's called money? Credits? Wait, money? Credits? Money, money. Oh, credits. wait a minute. Hey, Al. Hey, Al. Hey, no They're going to get money back. Money comes oh. back, oh, Money no. comes back yeah. from our hey, taxpayers. He's smarter our than consumers. me. I admit it. Hey, does He's the money come to. back from the consumers that are paying the electric bills? Yeah, some does come out of the electric what bills. What money from other states did to us? Pollution credits, Al. Pollution credits. Pollution so, credits. If, people take their pollution is credits. It comes back. Is that money? Can New Hampshire has so many credits. You so if a state you says we, we, you want to get rid of it, he, does can, he yes. want to get rid of it? Can people take so, pollution wait, wait, credits it, and go buy milk it, and bread it, for their it, family? Excuse me. They can well, get. It, yes. They can file an application to make their home more fuel efficient. Oh, give it a break! Million dollar there we homes go. to get this done. Ladies no, any and home, gentlemen, any home, a home I in London dairy can get this. Listen to this. I oh, love you. You gotta come back. Homes in London dairy are participating. No, no, look at him. Million dollar. Million dollar. No, no, look, look at him. Are getting their homes. Anybody can efficient. get it. Anybody, anybody can get it, Al. Anybody. And meanwhile, Grandma and, uh, you know, the no, kids. No, 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 no. They, they can the get insulated. Mom is paying no, they get insulated. No, she can put your, you know, friends, your elderly friends. What benefit your... if she lives in a apartment, a single mom? What's the benefit? What does she get? A single mom. What benefit? Rent an apartment. Excuse me. No, abs uh, yeah, yeah. What, what, what is she? she gets plenty of benefit, Al. Like what? Better air quality, <laughs> cheaper electricity because no, we're not, not sending it right out the window. Fuel, more, fuel oh, no, 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 more fuel efficiency. More fuel efficiency. If if they insulate the place and they put in better windows, that individual who lives there will spend less money Why did you for electricity, Why wasn't for means heating, tested? for air conditioning. Why wasn't and you know that Al, means tested? You see this guy? It's all. He's my if main someone, man. Anyone can file an application. I can tell you, I'm not. Familiar with the entire application <laughs> process, but anybody, home. anybody can file, and they do an assessment of the home. And it, people, whether they're rich or I'm poor, gonna, have taken advantage. There's a, I'm gonna there's call a community. Them there's and a community. See if they will come to my house the, and insulate uh, my home. There's a community. You have too much money, Al. You drive one of those big. Expensive Why? cars. I don't have a yeah, well, 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 wait, wait a minute. Those big gas guzzling <laughs> cars. That's right. Whoa. Al Gore. It, it, oh, it, here we go, it Al Gore. Sucks hey, it in. Al Gore, get rid of your big, uh, you know, Escalades and your SUVs. He's flying around in jets. He's got a six, seven thousand dollars square, 
7,000 square foot home, but everyone else downsized. It, he it, made it, millions off me, of that. He, no, 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 no. James. If I remember correctly. Democrats all drive in these smaller cars. I have a small escape. I don't have a big Escalade, you know. <laughs> and, I, and I got this tiny little little thing that I drive around in. No, stop you your whining. <laughs> stop like this. your whining. I'll tell you. Because All right. choice. Okay, hold I on a second. people's choice. We've got to get to, Okay, so you, so so we've kind of done this. We Please come back. Will you come back? Oh, sure. All right, I, okay. As Ladies long as Al wants me uh, back, you know. See? And you right, okay. too. I'll tell you what. If Al doesn't show up, you're coming on with me. <laughs> All, right. <laughs> All right. I love this guy. Now I like you, too. <laughs> now, we're best of friends now. I want you to know that. See, he's a I politician. Love his a I'm getting better at it. His fiance. He's a politician. I'm waiting for him to get married. Huh? I'm waiting for the wedding. You're well, going to get you'll... married? I'll have to invite both of you he's now. Been, yeah. He's been engaged for 20 years. No, eight years. Eight years. Oh, okay. yeah. You've been engaged That's for eight like years. That's like those Republicans always exaggerating, yeah. you know. <laughs> I, I don't believe this. Uh, All right, okay. I want to talk about something that happened in, in actually there were two bills that took that came into uh, uh, our committee, which is commerce, banking, insurance, and consumer oh, affairs. Oh, my friend John Hunt. Yeah, that's a... Oh, John? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He's my friend, too. Uh, so we had somebody, and by the way, I, I'm going to try to get this on my uh, iPad, and I'll read the bill. Your name is on it. Mm -hmm. Your I name is on this bill. Uh, is it 129? No. Okay, I want to talk to you on it. I think it's 129, because him and I have been talking for the last year while he's looking, right? And I kept saying, you're on commerce. Why aren't you going across state lines, putting in uh, insurance? Um, you know, bill and go, go businesses. For insurance, yeah, insurance, or insurance or health insurance? Health insurance. Or? Oh, no, he hasn't done it. I hear there's a bill in their committee, and they're talking about killing it to go across the uh, Oh, border. come on. Is there a bill in your committee to go across where people can go into mass and other states to get cheaper insurance? Which there should be. I'll yeah. agree with you there. Is there a bill in your committee? Uh, there are lots of bills, but let me talk is about this. We've got six <laughs> minutes. No, no, no. we got six minutes left. Okay. This has been fast. Has it, would you Very say? fast. Very yeah. fast. Okay. Every time I'm with Al, it's fast. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's known as fast. I Eddie. still yeah. see him all the time. You know that. I the hell with it. I won't talk about it. <laughs> all right. Go ahead. All right. Your, na your name is on this bill, and, and uh, the gentleman's name is Webb. Uh, he is in Fishing Game, and this is what the bill says. This is it. This bill requires property and casualty insurance to make certain information available to a consumer if such information reflects negative on their policy rate. Right. That one What's sentence, wrong with that? one sentence, now mm -hmm. up comes the commissioner, one of the commissioners or assistant commissioner. From from uh, uh, you, you insurance. know the insurance yeah, department, that I and, get over there. and she says, you know, that would be a really a good idea because we're getting so many calls and they're saying our rates are going up and, and we don't know why. Mm -hmm. And, okay. and okay. so here's a policy, and he brought it in. It's from uh, uh, well, I won't mention the, the the carrier, and he he showed everything, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, he his rate, uh, uh, his daughter's rates or somebody's went up, and and he tried to figure it out and. So we call uh, the commissioner over, you know, the insurance, and the insurance commissioner came up, and they're saying, oh, well, you know, uh, we'd like that because we don't know. They don't know. You get your policy, right. and your policy goes up. You don't know, and you can't figure out, and the insurance people up in Concord can't figure it out. So guess what? Up steps two, two lobbyists. Two lobbyists. Is that and a you bad know what? bill? Oh, yeah. Bad bill, one sentence. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Bad bill, one sentence. Guess what? The computers do this. This is what they said. The computers do this. They've been doing it for 20 years. Mm -hmm. They know exactly how to do it. I don't know how to figure it out, he says. But guess what? You should have stopped it 20 mm -hmm. years ago. Right. Now we can't stop it. He says, he says, there's nothing that you can do about it. And he's looking at us, and we're this going... What? Is nothing we can do in algorithm, you know? It, it, it's all set up, in the th and we're all going, what are you, nuts? They've, are you trying to tell us mm -hmm. that we can't find out why you have 
you know, well, added something here. Deal, well, deal, wait, wait. Explain what it is. It deals with the credit oh, reports. I get, if people, which can be no, wrong. No, no. Everything. Right. But what I'm trying to say is you're be focused married. On, the, on the credit report. Uh, because people, when you're down and out, the economy is bad, lost their job, got late. Now, all of a sudden, you're going to punish them. Carry oh, down. Guess for seven what? years. And yeah. guess what? I was hit by a car. Mm -hmm. My insurance went up. Right. All but right. This is, this so, is why. And by the way... I only figured that out. I couldn't find it in my policy. Mm -hmm. So that one sentence, one sentence, mm -hmm. they sent two lobbyists in, yeah. and uh, I guess two states have completely eliminated it. In other That's words, right. they, they must That's do right. it. They did. They 16 told states are looking into it. Pass that. So up comes. Now you've got some good legislation, oh, buddy. Your name is on it. I know it is. I told you. Your name is, You didn't yeah. know your name I was know. on it. Yes, it was. I you didn't even you. know your How name. Did I, know about the I, I, How did I know about the bill? I know about the bill. All right. Anyway, yeah. what, what we. What I we so I hope your committee supports that bill. Well, you know, the, the, those Republicans. I'm telling you. Yes, we're bad oh, people, I, I, I'm, no, no, Republicans stuck up for mm -hmm. the, you know, uh, the, this big computer in the sky that figures this all out, and you don't have to tell people mm -hmm. why their insurance go. You know how stupid that is mm -hmm. for anyone to get up and to talk right. against a one-line bill. Mm -hmm. That's why we thought it was a good bill. A one simple line bill mm -hmm. that simply says if it if your credit if you have something negative mm -hmm. on your credit or on your uh, insurance policy, but it's on your they credit that must it. tell That's you. That's right. Oh no, it can be everything. I know, but what we Number don't want credit them to cards. do is do a credit. We do don't you want know? them raising it because of you credit. You know, you know, Hunt, Mr. Hunt. Oh yes. His daughter's under 25 years old. Mr. Chairman, All right. You. She's 24 years old, and because she's 24, when she gets 25, her insurance will go down. Why is there a 25 year old? Excuse me, 24 year old woman. Mm -hmm. Having to spend more money. I agree. Why? That's crazy. You want to know why? Because they average it out across the country. Yeah. We pay That's for right. other people. Yeah. Now, these lobbyists were obviously from the insurance industry. Oh, it was awful. It was, it was one of those. That's All right, why. how can they get in touch with you, Peter? Well, my email is uh, probably on the screen. It's prleishman, L-E-I-S-H-M-A-N, at AOL.com. Uh, you on Facebook? I am on Facebook. Twitter? I am not on Twitter. What else are you on? That's about it. That's enough. I, I that's all I can hand, that's handle. That's all I know where to find him. Right. I'm friends with Al Baldazaro, and uh, that's all well, I need. That, right? yeah, and I I'll be friends yeah, with that, you next. Just, yeah, well, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> Al, how can I get in touch with you? Yeah. Yeah. Al, um, um, once again, uh, you can call me at 425-6997. You can get me on Twitter. You can get me on Facebook. You, I have a website, www.albaldazaro.com. Stop by my house, 41 Hall Stop Road by my in Londonderry, New Hampshire. We're we have a bus. fund to send them to Florida, one-way tickets. So That's right. You can I'll contribute to that. next week. Uh, <laughs> to, to work on your tan. I'm going to no, be, be hanging out with my granddaughters hey, take at the a, pool. Can you take your guns down there? Uh, if I can, yes. If I put them in my bag. I put them in my bag and I hop on the plane. Yeah. There we go. The yeah. that goes on the this, bird. Ladies uh, and gentlemen, my name is Ken Gidge. This is the Out of Politics. You can get me on Facebook. You can get me on Twitter. Also, all you have to do. Give your address. All you have, will you shut up? <laughs> shut up. No, I'm not giving yeah, my address. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 All right. Shut up. Just go to Gidge World. Gidge World will tell you everything you want to know about uh -huh. me. And even he's in it. And listen, Peter, you promise you're going to come back. Absolutely. I enjoyed myself. Peter, I think this hey. was a great show there. Yeah. yeah. Don't, don't yeah. go over to him. <laughs> come on. All right. We always start the show with a handshake. We always end it. We always try to have fun. He had facts. Yeah. You say, I don't have facts. Listen, thank you. Goodbye. I'm finally a Democrat that has facts. <laughs>
The preceding program was provided by an independent producer solely responsible for its content. The opinions expressed do not necessarily represent the views of this station, its staff, board of directors, or underwriters.